Hello everyone, my name is Hongusen and welcome back to this Imperator Rome Purple Phoenix campaign. So we are about to go to war with Egypt and this should be the last war with them at least. Uh, it would be good if we could finish off one of these um, annoying people. Well, not people. Um, ah, we died. So we now have Delos Sparato Kid. Okay, uh, where's our army? There you go. Delos, you had four, if I'm not mistaken. Either I'm mistaken or I am blind. No, nope, there you are. Okay. Uh, someone scorned now. It is Orestes. Well. I mean, to be fair, we could put whatever we want in charge here. It doesn't... Uh, we have someone who is decent here. Congratulations. Oh, excuse me. We are getting to the end game now anyway, so... Doesn't really matter. So we're going to put these guys on the boats, ship them down, and then just go and crush Egypt. So you, my friend, um, that's the best place to drop them off. Ah, oh, it's probably still there. Let's drop them off just there. And let's see, we wanted to start another fabrication on Carthage. Let's see. Um, what's this here? This is Eolia. Let's go for that one. So that one we definitely do want. But yeah, it doesn't feel like it took a great deal of land out of Carthage there, but... I mean, at least we got one of his tiny subjects, which is, you know, better than none of them. Um, but yeah, we do want to declare war on him as soon as we possibly can. Also, we're back up to having basically no aggressive expansion again, so that is um, great. Also, you could spread out a tiny bit. I know I'm the one who actually put you there, but just saying. Uh, Egypt, my friend, has 59,000 cohorts, which is actually quite impressive. Not impressive enough, of course, but at least he tried. So let's have you drop all of these guys off. And let's send, um, you can probably go down there and then we'll just take the rest of you over here. And then we should be good to go. Only problem with Egypt is that he does have quite a few different avenues to come around. Relocation policy, the motion speed. Ah, uh, yeah. Probably should have paid attention to what we were actually losing there, but don't think it really matters. Alright, we need a governor here, and apparently we're going to put whoever's... Well, have we got someone who's not a democrat? Yeah, this oligarchic person. Congratulations. See, oligarchy... Um, word? Pays off. Being a silly democrat does not, so just change your philosophy all right i think that's good enough so let's go for us here all right democrats are not going to approve we don't really care and that's such a tiny amount of tyranny that it doesn't really matter so let's go they have 11 we are up to 17 and let's research some more okay now, as far as Rome is concerned, I believe we have claims on everything we want over there, so we can just ignore that part. We should look at fabricating on you, though. Um, yeah. I think that in the next war, we'll just go for... Um, oh yeah, you should all be independent. Kind of forgot about that. And, and just hope that if we do crush him, then... Uh, or take as much land and weaken him as much as possible. That means that his subjects will rebel against him. 
Because that's really the only way out here. Um, oh, also we're kind of starving in some places here. South Phoenicia. Um, import all the grain you could possibly find. Where else? Um, Aeolia. That's, that. That's somewhere in Greek. Greece, isn't it? Uh, no. I'd say I was close, but that's a horse. I was about to say, you can't eat horses, but you can eat horses. It's fine. Right, and where else? North Phoenicia. Well, let's give you some more grain as well. There we go. The other ones are low on food, but they'll be fine. All right. So now these guys should do something, and it looks like they are. Oh, uh, what? Do I want the money? He's, he's going to be super disloyal regardless, so no, I'm just going to ignore him, and he can be as disloyal as he wants. Usually I do give them the job when they come and whine like that, but he's about to die and I'm sure money would be nice, but we don't need money. Alright, what are you up to? Oh, you're going crossing down that way. Hmm, yeah, I can get behind that. Do we actually not have... No, we do have that slow... Re oh, we don't actually own anything in Upper Egypt. No, we do. Well, tell you what, you should have an army then as well. So let's sort you out with one. Oh, that was a quick occupation. Very nice. Come to think of it. I'm not sure. Maybe we get some other event and if we haven't fulfilled them, maybe they'll rebel against us. I mean, they can try. Or more likely is that he's just going to be even more whiny. Where are you going? Right, okay. Sign you to the region and... Um, sorry, I was counting there. And get you to help out as well. We do still have some subjects up there, so there will be more people helping out in this war. And he has no allies. <laughs> well, uh, but he does have a lot of camels, so that kind of makes up for it. Can't get allies, get camels. Mm. What? Oh, it's these guys. Oh, okay, okay. Right, are we okay with the food front at the moment? Cyprus is kind of dodgy. Um, current imports, cloth, which is an internal trade route. Uh, let's get rid of that one and get you some shiny grain instead. There we go. They should be fine now. everyone else is okay all right that one's done let's go and grab that city and actually get some money out of this as well oh yeah here we go alchemakos blah 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 continuing yeah we'll be even more displeased yeah we can make him lose prominence Excellent. Less prominence equals less money. Uh, equals less power for him. Hmm. Who are you? 
the governor or somewhere. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> right. Uh, you're that guy who's never going to be disloyal, so we're just going to ignore you. You really don't matter. Right, who are you? You're just the head of a family and you're just whiny because low faction approval. Well, stop being part of a crappy faction. It's not rocket science. And then we have this governor here who is also part of the wrong faction. He's not quite dying yet though. Although probably soon. Well, let's give him free hands. Right. Food is looking... Well, it's positive everywhere, so... I think we can ignore that. There we go. Any other city as well? I'm not quite sure I'd call that a city, but it seems to have two buildings, so... Let's go and get it. Yeah, you can have whatever money you want. Unrivaled wealth, 10k or 1k. Ha! Huh. I laugh at you. There we go. That's all of those sorted. Excellent stuff. So now, well, this is the province which we actually need for the war goal. Unfortunately, every single one of our mercs have decided to go run away from here because, well, they couldn't get past it. Um, right. Okay, for some reason you did not get... None of you managed to get the sign. That's weird. Usually it works fine. Okay, something's gone very weird here. Okay, well, I'll just leave that then. In the meantime, we'll keep sieging down this stuff here. I guess I'll do it myself then, just to make sure we get the ticking war score as soon as possible. Uh, my... I keep calling them subjects, they're not subjects, my mercenaries. Well, they are subjects, I mean. Subject to my will. We'll keep sieging down random things anyway to get more war score, so we'll just do that and... Um, Capital doesn't have a great deal of food. I think we probably want to get some more grain going there just to be on the safe side. And of course we do want more aqueducts. Never go wrong with more aqueducts. Okay. <sighs> yeah, you're perfect. More power to the oligarchs. And more claims. That was on Carthage, wasn't it? We could fabricate on these tiny ones there. Or that one. Still can't fabricate on you, unfortunately. I mean, we could fabricate on Oretania and then just take things that we haven't fabricated on. Also, we do need you, don't we? You are of course a feudatory of Carthage as well. Stupid Carthage. Right, there's five more provinces here that we need to siege down. After that we are good to go. So when can I remove you here or... This is so dumb. Uh, 
Well, it doesn't look like he's got any troops down here at least. But I'm still not sure where they are. So why are we having a death stack moving down there? Oh. Best not to ask. I'm sure the AI knows what they're doing. So yeah, everyone should be okay down there now. So we'll see. I'm not quite sure whether we want much more um, than this. I don't think we want all of Upper Egypt. We want some, probably just want these, I don't know, three provinces here. You know, maybe that one as well. We'll see. We'll get a bit more wars because we need, do need to siege down capitals, etc. etc. We want sort of this area here and this, something like that, maybe. Then we'll just go from there. Let's at least get the ticking war score, and then we can look at working out a peace deal after that. Think of the children! No, you can have the money. Children can get their own money. None of you have any food. Are we not producing any f Oh, we don't own the capital! Oh! Just brilliant. Okay, now we're talking. Uh, you, my friend. Okay, all the things. Okay, he's decided to run away now. I want to say this is. Um, a bit scary because that is a huge death stack. Uh, and it's decided to go for this army now. Well, you are going to be horribly, horribly crushed. I can tell you that much. We'll see if you can at least. Well, maybe that means we can trade up a new unit for him instead. That's not bugged out. I did manage to um, get the the word capital back oh my god so many pop-ups um yeah give you a fine right upper egypt oh did he die wow okay <laughs> uh well uh, how about no he didn't or is that someone else who just looks the same? Oh, well, I don't know. And to be fair, it doesn't really matter. Also, why... Well, there's two of you here. Uh, so you go there. And you is the one I wanted to be over here and possibly protect this army in case of something happening. I mean, there's nothing protecting this area over here, so that is just getting wrecked. Backwards and forwards and all the ways in between. But ticking war score is ours. I'm hoping he'll come in here and try and fight me. I would love it. He might do it. He is going to do it. Okay. Let's wait until they lock. So we have a shitty one there. We have a better one there. He's got a decent one. He is locked. So it's March. So he'll get there on the 14th of August, which is tomorrow. This will probably be quicker if we do it like that. I will be the same. Okay, he is running a moose, so we should be running the rhino. Nice. Okay. Fortunately, we are rolling awful. Oh my god, more governors are dying. 
We should, should just sort this by age and put someone in charge, so can we just leave them there? We are going to put this glorious oligarch in charge though. Could not possibly do anything wrong. There we go. Okay. So now you are free to go about your business. Um, you... I'm not sure whether there are many more cities down here to actually... Oh wow, there's one there. Was one there. So we can probably have a quick look here. Um, excuse me. I'm actually going to make you independent as well. What do you think you're doing? Yes, we'll definitely be friends with you. Yeah, 2k more manpower. Definitely going to help us. You are gone on the third. <laughs> ah, Egypt. We are going to get... Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, really by Egypt. Uh, of course we're going to have a glorious festival. Right, let's have a quick look then at the war score or the war whatever thing, peace deal. So we do want those ones. Tempted to get like that and that. Something like that. I think that's adequate. And then maybe we'll take these two here, but that's just very, very awkward to do. We can do it like, okay, well, something like that. Oh, now it's only taking those ones. Oh. Why game? Why you do this to me? Okay, so if we do that and then take, yeah. Something like that, 59 war score, it's 40 away from it right now, but that, if we have a look at the map, looks okay, I think. Yeah. Okay. Uh, right. But we do need more war score, so let's just keep the war go going. Well, war going. It is down to low. But it does have so much freaking land down here. Oh well. Um, it is almost time to start finishing this episode as well, but I think we can let it run a bit longer. Oh, you want to be a client state as well? Sure. Okay, we're apparently fighting them over here as well. I'm sure that will, yeah. Easy peasy. You seem to be not doing much. All right, and we were supposed to build a new army over here, which hopefully won't get broken this time. Oh, nice. There we go didn't realize you were actually doing something useful. Very nice. So 39. Um, it's just so much freaking. I don't know where his big provinces are. I mean, he does have cities, etc. down here. So I guess those are the ones that are providing or bulking up his total war score required, but we'll get there eventually. Wow! Jesus Christ! A group of senators with a vested interest in military matters of the state have asked you, the physician, to represent their interest. Oh, okay. 
claiming that they're becoming increasingly displeased with the direction our great nation is taking, they have issued an ultimatum. They are demanding that we address the lack of marvelous iconography in the senatorial chamber. What? Lose 10 approval from the oligarchs. It's growing at the moment, I think. We will ignore the whining. We're still over, over 60, so yeah. It's going to pay you freaking 7k? That's ridiculous. And yes, more Olympics. That's what we'll do instead. That will keep you occupied. Alright, uh, notice that this episode is getting a bit long, so I am going to call it here. As always, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!